Oh boy. Yeah. We're talking about Switch Pro again. Or new gen Switch or something. I I don't even know with new Nintendo Switch. Yeah, I know. Automatic dislikes, people bitching in the comments. But here's the thing. Um Shintura Furukawa was asked about it, and he gave a very interesting response. I know it's going to depend on what side of the fence you are when you uh, hear this response. Uh, he was asked about this at an investors meeting last night. Uh, his response is very, very interesting because if you believe Switch Pro is real, this is going to feel like a lot of evidence that it is. Uh, if you think it's not real, you're going to be able to spin it that way as well. That's the fun thing about this whole debate on if it's even real or not. Forget when it's coming out. Uh, on top of that, a new game was announced for Nintendo Switch, but not for Switch. It was announced for Switch 2 or Next Gen Nintendo. What? By the way, before we get into this video, we are giving away two copies of Skyward Sword HD. Head down into the description to find a link to enter. So first, let's get into the big stuff here. We got we got Shintaro Furukawa at the investors meeting. He was asked this exact question. Here's the quote. The announcement of Splatoon 3 was good. It reassured me that I can still play my Switch next year. There were reports of a new Switch, and without an announcement at E3, the stock price dropped significantly. When the rumor started, I wondered if there was anything I could do about it. Will there actually be a new Switch model? That's it. Pretty simple question, right? Well, Shintura Furukawa didn't really mince words. Very, very interesting response. Every time He's been asked this, by the way, in a bunch of investors' meetings over the past year. And every single time he talks, it seems, at least to me, to make it feel like there's more and more evidence to support the fact that Nintendo's doing something. I don't know what it is. It's something. But that's my take. Let's get into his exact words. Furukawa said, We release information at the right time. As for the new model, we refrain from discussing specifics. Okay. However, we will continue to pursue fun going forward, and we will make an announcement when the time is right. Now look, you can take these words to mean anything you want, right? You could twist them to one side of the argument or another. I'm just going to take them at face value. Will there actually be a new Switch model? One, we will release information at the right time. Okay, well, if there's not going to be a new Switch model, wouldn't you just say it? there's not going to be a new Switch model? The question was, will there be a new Switch model? The response is, we're going to release information at the right time. So they don't think the time is right yet. As for a new model, specifically to the new model, we are going to refrain from giving specific information, right? We're not going to discuss specifics about that model. However, we will continue to pursue the fun going forward, and we will make an announcement when the time is right. This sounds like Shintura Furukawa, at least to me, is acknowledging, acknowledging that a model does exist. A new model is coming. The time's not right to talk about it right now. We're not going to talk about specifics about that model right now, but we are going to continue to pursue fun, and hey, we're going to make that announcement when we think it's the right time. He's not denying a new model switch exists. Remember, the question was, does a new model exist? He didn't say no. Instead, he said, hey, look, we're not really going to give you details on that model, but like when we're ready to, when the time is right, we're going to. So like, to me, Shintura Furukawa is someone who does think the, the, the Pro or whatever they call this, a new Nintendo Switch probably you know, comes out, that it's going to be at what Nintendo feels is the right time. The right time might not be right now while the Switch is continuing to sell out. But he's just saying, Furukawa was just putting out there, hey, look, we're not denying this thing exists but we're not going to talk about it till the time is right. That's what I take out of it. Now, here's what's also really interesting. So this was published at Tech Radar, so not a small website. Uh, it says the first Nintendo Switch 2 game may have just been announced. All right, so there was a Q&A on, on uh, Kickstarter for a developer um, who's making a game called Euden Chronicles 100 Heroes and, it's, and what, what systems it's going to release on day one. Uh, so Rabbit Bear Studios, the company behind it, um, you know, basically said, yeah, it's going to come come to like PlayStation 4, Xbox, you know, it's going to be coming to Series X and S and, and PlayStation 5. Uh, but yeah, it's also going to come to Nintendo's next gen hardware. Um, as originally pledged to the backers, the game will release on Xbox One, Xbox Series X slash S, PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5, Steam, Epic Games, or so PC and Nintendo's next generation hardware. Now, 
He didn't specify in this Q&A if that next generation hardware meant Switch Pro or if it actually means what next gen usually means, which is Switch 2. But yeah, there's already a game confirmed to be coming to hardware that isn't in anyone's hands and we don't even know exists. So there you have it. You have one developer committing a game to it. You have Nintendo saying, hey, look, we're not going to say a new model Switch isn't coming. What we are going to say is we're not going to give you details on that right now, but we will reveal it when the time is right. To me, Nintendo's acknowledging it exists, and now we have a, a developer saying, yeah, we're making a game for it, or at least for something new that Nintendo's working on. I don't know. I'm just throwing it out there. I don't know what any of this means. I'm not, you know, a, a, a wizard. I don't have all of the answers. I know there's going to be people in the comments, oh, my gosh, it's not what Brian Kevin said. He didn't say we're going to reveal it when the time is right. What he meant is, uh, yeah, whatever hardware we work on, new generation, we're going to reveal that when the time is right. Oh, my. Whatever. Oh, my God, that's real. It's fake. You're such a liar, Nate. Such a liar. I hate you. Oh, my God, that last video you did. Did you see that last video? Nintendo's too woke for this shit. Oh, my God, guys. Can we calm down? I'm just giving you the information that's out there. I'm a tech enthusiast. I'm interested in new hardware. There's a game that's already announced right now for next generation. I don't know what you want me to do. I'm going to continue to make the videos I want to make. And if you guys don't want to watch, it's all right. Click to a different video or unsubscribe or whatever. I don't really care. Nintendo, to me, just basically admitted the thing exists and we're just not ready to reveal it yet. Take that for what you will. Call me whatever you want to call me. Trust me, I can take it. Also, as we round out this video, what are you guys thinking? You notice anything different about me? Do I look a little uh, more dashing? Oh, you guys let me know what I look like down in the comments below. I am Nintendo RoboJets from the Center Prime. Thank you so much for tuning in, and I'll catch each and every one of you in the next video.